What's up, this is M Squared, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how I made a track using Serato Sample 2.0. Okay, so let's get right into the session. As you can see, I already started a track. I was just so hyped to uh, jump right in and get started on this new update for Serato 2.0, but I'll show you what I did here. So the first thing I did was I put Serato Sample on. So this is Serato Sample 2.0. I'm gonna drag a loop in. Let's play this first. So I'm at 123 BPM. The first thing I did was isolate the drums. So using the brand new stems feature, I took out all of the other elements here. And as you can see, it does take some time to process. Okay, so I'm gonna jump back to the front of the loop. I'm gonna click on set slicer. I'm gonna choose the set slicer option. Now I should have all of my drums completely isolated without hearing any of the guitar. That is amazing. Okay, so the first thing I did was I took a kick out of that loop. This is it here. I just recorded a 4-4 pattern with that kick, as you can see. So the next element that I chose was a snare out of that same loop. I just opened another instance of Serato Sample so it can be on its own track. So this is a snare from that same loop. I just recorded that. The next element I chose was the hats from that particular loop. Again, just opened another instance of Serato Sample, found the hats that I liked, and recorded that pattern. The next element, a percussive element that I wanted to add to that loop. This is all coming from the same loop that had the guitars in it. So I just wanted to add one more percussive hit. Okay, so now I'm gonna open another instance of Serato Sample here. So now this is a soul loop that I chopped up. And what I'm gonna do is play it straight through, and then we're gonna isolate the different elements. So this is a loop that I chopped earlier. So as you can hear, there are many different things going on in this loop here. You have drums, strings, vocals. And what I'm gonna do is basically take the drums out so that that loop can sit better with the drums that I had just recorded. All right, so I'm gonna record that in. All right, so we have that loop recorded. But as you can hear, the drums from this loop are kind of clashing with the drums that I had recorded prior to this loop. So I'm gonna go in and let's take the drums out using Serato Sample, using the new stems feature. So I'm gonna go to the drum icon here, turn that off, let it take its time to process. And depending on how long or short the sample is, obviously the longer the sample that you choose to put in to Serato Sample, the longer it's gonna take to process and analyze the different elements that you're choosing to isolate or bring in. So just keep that in mind. So now this is the sample without drums. So as you can see, it sits much better in the mix without any mixing yet. This is just, we took the drums away. All right, I'm just gonna bounce that down to audio here. Great, so now we have that as an audio file to itself.
We're gonna try removing the strings and the vocal and see how this sounds with just the bass line. Here we go. As you can see, I had to increase the level, but it sounds pretty good. Wow. There it is, isolated. Oh yeah, this is amazing. So I'm gonna bounce this down to audio. Now we want just the vocal. So we go to the icons up here, as you can see, and I have just the vocal icon selected. So this should be isolating any vocal information in this loop. Wow. Serato, thank you, thank you, Serato. Wow. This is crazy. That is pretty clean. I'm going to bounce that. And now for the final element, I want to keep just the strings isolated. So I'm going to go here, select the keyboard icon and deselect the vocal icon. Now let's take a listen to how this sounds with just the strings. Oh, wow. This is amazing. Oh my goodness. Yes. Yes, Serato. Yes. Oh, this is crazy. I'm going to bounce that. Okay, so as you can see, I was able to make this track only using two loops and breaking down all the different individual elements within each loop. Let's hear it back. Strings. Vocals. Bass. Kick, snare, hats, percussion, strings, vocals, bass. There it is, Serato Sample 2.0 with the Stems feature. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please be sure to like, share, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you in the next video.